Hello, my friends of Catari Labs. My name is Jorge Montoya. Please welcome to this um, tutorial. This tutorial is about the interactive exploration of shape files with, on JupyterLab with IP leaflet on Pola. Okay, we have done in this tutorial something that could be done, could be called as a small app. Uh, and then you will see how it works. Okay, so here, if you are on the Docker image of uh, Hakuchik, or whether you are in Hattari Labs, in hakuchi.hattarilabs.com uh, you can deploy this tutorial. Why this image or why this cloud? Because uh, it comes with the, all the libraries required for this, like IP leaflet, voila, geopanda, gdal, and so on. Yeah? If you are using a normal Anaconda distribution, it might be difficult to reach this installation, or by your own. No? it will be better and much quicker if you do the do that using docker okay so let's say git clone so we are going to clone a repository here which is the repository this one okay and on the repository <clears throat> we have two folders First one is the script where we are going to have the scripts and the other is the check file that here it has only two check files but however it can have 10, 4 or 5 or maybe 20 check files because actually the code is not limited by the, is not limited by the amount of check files okay so here on a script you are going to see this okay but actually you are not going to code anything why? Because if you deploy this with Voila, you are going to get, this is what you are going to get, okay? So, uh, it has the list of chef files, mm -hmm. it has um, a button here, of select chef file, for example, let's create, let's select this chef file, if I select this one, actually it will zoom to the extension, I mean, it, well, it will zoom to the shape file, to the extension of the shape file, yes. And then you can do some, you can increase the zoom here. You can, uh, for example, you can plot a topo map here in case that you are, you can change the, the background map, okay, upon your necessities, okay. And then even that you can uh, expand the you can expand the the display in order to have a better view or add a better comprehension of what is going on here. Okay. Um, for example, if I want to select the other chip file, I can go here. I can press select chip file, and the chip file will appear here as well. Okay. So this is a um, powerful tool if you want to explore chip files that were given to you or like uh, uh, like those chip files come from your spatial analysis or whatever chip file that you might have on a Jupyter lab environment without going to um, to QAS. However, uh, you can tune or you can personalize this on the code because you can create, uh, you can insert rulers, you can insert, uh, you can customize the colors as well, or like you can, you can insert rulers, you can customize the colors, you can create Hoover, like like some test, some text could appear if you do click, if you click on some of the features, or you can do with it, I mean, very, much powerful things if you if you want to develop some time to coding in this platform okay however uh, as a first step i think that this tutorial was good enough um, thank you for following us till here uh, hope to see you in coming tutorials hope to see you in coming courses and have a good day and stay safe um, and subscribe to our youtube channel if you haven't done so okay my name is Ormotoya. Have a great day. See you. Bye bye.